I was a soldier once. The things I saw, the things I did. I thought it was my duty. I believed in the impossible. I did as I was told, and now I find myself in a place where I can't crawl out. The darkness, the abyss, hell. My name is Wilhelm Hartmann, former private in the Imperial German Army. I've seen hate, I've seen fear, I've seen suffering. All of this gives birth to a new individual, one who doesn't feel human anymore, one who becomes unrecognizable. No compassion, no pity, no love, no soul. Devoid a human of these characteristics and then you've got them under your spell. You can plant whatever thoughts and feelings you want and they will carry out those instructions without question. The stupid, the young, all become blind with false ideas, fighting for ideas that don't exist only to die in the process. They fight for nothing. They die for nothing. I was told hopes that could only be achieved by showing strength. 
no pity for those we were told were weaker than us. An idea was being painted for us, and we carried the brush. We could either finish painting it, or erase it. But if we erased it, we erase everything with it. Every drop of paint has to go, and those that remained would be given the painful removal. Torn off, ripped apart for everyone to see, you become the drop that everyone despises because you stand alone. As you stand alone, you see all your so-called brothers in arms glaring at you, furious at such betrayal, whilst the sons and daughters you are defending only point and cry at you. Now you've become the enemy. The enemy that no one has ever met, but holds so much hatred for. Imagine being awarded a medal just for surviving. Nice to know they only care for the ones that survive. A reminder that they have use of you. Hypocrisy at its finest. They award bravery medals to the dead whilst they sit on the sidelines out of the line of fire. Yet somehow, they retain all the glory. More like retain all the shame and blood of all those they sent to die. In that moment, I knew. 
my life would never be the same. When I looked at my hands, I saw nothing but blood, and the faces of those I had to put to an eternal rest. My body felt empty as my soul was non-existent. I was raised never to take a life. Maybe once I pulled that trigger, I solidified myself to my fate. A dark ending because of a dark choice. Guess I do deserve it in the end. moments like this I can only imagine what the future must hold for the next generation. A generation brought up in a world of lies and deceit. Will they ever question the ideology that they've been brought up with? Will they ever break free of the curse they have been unknowingly bestowed with? Are they doomed to walk as mindless hounds for the rest of their lives? And are we destined to become forgotten history? Time may tell, but it only takes a sole individual to make a difference. But it will take a lot of courage for someone to stand up to the issue that looms over us today. As Edmund Burke once said, the only thing necessary for the triumph of evil is for good men to do nothing. Maybe one day, society will begin to overturn this, and should that day ever come round, war may finally be over. <laughs>